Aslamu alaikum everyone, yes I'm back with a new video. Today's video is featuring another slime video. What is it this time? Yes, we'll be making Orbi slime. In other words, DIY Orbi's glass putty. So, let's get started. To make this fun squishy slime, you'll need a batch of your favorite slime. Any kind will do. For this particular video, I am using my tried and tested clear slime recipe. All you need is a good quality PVA clear glue and a slime activator. I am using the diluted liquid tide. The Orbeez are very slippery, so I will use a sticky slime so that the pellets will stick to the slime more. Please note that the Orbeez are soft and squishy and they will fall out from time to time. This Orbi slime recipe combines two things that everyone will love to play and be stress-free. Yes, slime and Orbeez. You will need Orbeez. These start out as very small hard beads. When you soak these pellets in water, they grow in size. The brand of these water gel beads will determine the quality of the Orbeez. And also for how long you soak them will determine the size of the Orbeez. A great thing about these Orbeez is when they dry out, they will go back to their original size and shape. We are combining two great textures together to make yet another awesome slime. So make the Orbeez first. You want to activate your pellets first. Do this according to whatever Orbe brand that you have chosen. Normally you will just place your Orbeez in a large bowl. I'm using a metal bowl here with water. Lots of water. You will want to make sure that you have a large enough bowl to allow the water beads to expand. Remember, they are going to grow 5 to 10 times their size, so they need room to grow. Do not overcrowd them. It will take a couple of hours for them to get them fully expanded. I left these overnight. For this particular video, I am not using a lot of Orbeez in the slime because they will eventually fall out. Just keep putting them back in. The slime didn't turn out to be very clear. Once I added the Orbeez and started playing with the slime, the slime started getting really cloudy. But when I stretch it, it looks really gorgeous. Ah, I get it now. Orbs, Orbeez. Oh my god, I'm so slow. There are so many ways you can have fun with Orbeez. Yes, you can squish them in, pat them in, throw them in, crush them in. Yes, you can crush the Orbeez and place them inside your slime. Make it look like crushed ice in a way. Now, this is part of the fun of playing with Orbeez slime. Now, Orbeez, oof, they're so bouncy, squishy, super fun water beads. Keep yourself entertained with the ultra vibrant and exquisite magic beads. I already mentioned that these are very small, but when you add water, they grow many times their original size. Beautiful smooth jelly beads when you add water and no two Orbeez will be same. They will all grow differently. But I did want to mention something that these gel beads, also known as water beads, were actually used in place of soil for indoor houseplants. Because they were non-toxic, they were multicolored gel beads, they readily absorbed water and release it to the plant's roots gradually. Orbeez has a lot of uses. It's an amazing product. Hashtag not sponsored. One, if you really enjoyed watching this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, press the bell icon so you're notified of any future videos that I might post, leave a constructive comment, and share this video. I really appreciate it. As always, thank you so much for your support and encouragement. Thanks for watching. Until next time, Allah Hafiz. Bye.